Today I'm going to show you how I download my TikTok videos with no watermark for shorts and reels. Welcome to the channel. If you're new here, I'm Tyler, aka Tyly Talk, and on this channel I design, redesign, and critique logos. So if that's your thing, then please go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Now I actually got my start on the internet posting on TikTok, and I amassed a good amount of followers there and a good library of videos. I'd always wanted to get more organized by posting on shorts and reels, but it just seemed kind of like too much of a hassle. But I finally went ahead and did it about a month and a half ago. And since then, my numbers have been crazy on YouTube and we were actually almost up to 40,000 subscribers on here, which is crazy. So I thought I would share how I went about doing this and just give that insight for anybody who might have a big library of TikTok videos and wants to post them on other platforms. So the first thing you're gonna do is go to your TikTok account. So you can actually just go to tiktok.com slash at your handle name and copy the link for the video you want to post onto shorts or reels. Then you're going to go to musicaldown.com. It used to be musicallydown.com, which is what TikTok used to be, but now it's just musicaldown.com. And you'll paste that link in there. There's actually a bunch of sites like this. So you could really type in anything on Google, like download TikTok with no watermark, and you should find a site. But I like this one because there's very few, actually there's no pop-up ads, which is kind of unheard of for sites like this. So you put the link in and then you click download MP4 now, and it's just gonna automatically download it straight into your downloads. Okay, so I'm seeing the video in my downloads and then I'm just gonna go over to YouTube and create upload video, and you can either do this on desktop or on your phone. So if you want to do it on your phone, you could either like email, text, or airdrop the video to your phone. I'm going to drag it from the downloads. And all you have to do when you upload the video on desktop is you just have to make sure that you put hashtag shorts somewhere in the title or description. And as long as it's a vertical video that's under a minute long, when you put that hashtag in there, it'll automatically post it to the shorts feed. And from there, you can just fill everything else out and either publish it or schedule it at the end. You can do the same thing for reels. Unfortunately, you can't schedule those ahead of time. You'll just have to post them or make a draft of it in your phone. And really, it's as easy as that. Hopefully, this will help you get that boost to take your content from TikTok and put it elsewhere. And I wish you all good luck with subscribers and growth in the future. If you like this video or found it helpful, please drop me a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.